Welcome back to my channel. My name is Justin Klumbala. Thanks so much for coming back. I'm very excited about today's video. We're going to be talking about three different types of shots you can hit around the green. A low trajectory shot, a medium trajectory shot, and a high trajectory shot. How do you hit these three different types of shots when you're around the green? Let's get right into it. So the first shot we're going to be talking about is a low trajectory shot. So if I wanted to hit a low trajectory shot, first off, I want to play the ball a little bit more off of my back foot. So if I'm hitting this more of the this ball off my back foot, it's going to help me get the shaft a little bit more leaning forward and get that ball to go out a little bit lower. Getting that getting that club with a little bit less loft is caused by having that shaft just a little bit more forward. And then as I go back and through, it's going to be a little bit more of a wristier shot here. And as I come back, I'm going to feel like I keep the club a little bit more on the closed side in the backswing. And then when I come through, I'm going to release my hand, but I'm going to release it in a roll-like fashion. So when I come through, I'm going to feel like my hands roll over to get the toe to turn up, which will get the ball to shoot out at a lower trajectory. So as you can see, this ball's on my back, back foot. I bring the back club back a little bit with a little bit more of a closed face. And then I'm feeling that right hand roll over as I come through the ball. Now let's get into the medium trajectory shot. So this is more of kind of your just standard pitch shot that you're not trying to do anything really tricky with it. You're just kind of hitting just a normal shot. This one's gonna play the ball more in the middle of our stance. And as we go back and through, we're just gonna hinge the club back to create a little angle on this side. And then we're gonna to try to match that angle on the other side here. So all I'm doing is I'm going angle back with the left arm and the club creating an angle. As you can see, maybe my left arm will go maybe about just parallel to the ground, but if my left arm is parallel to the ground, I'm going to match it on the other side. If my left arm points down to the ground, I'm going to match that on the other side. If my left arm points more towards the sky, I'm going to match that on the other side. So this one's kind of that medium type of shot here, very standard shot, where the backswing and the follow-through kind of match each other. Let's take a look at that. Ball position middle hinging it back right away. And then as I come through, I wanna kinda of get that shaft to be straight up and down as well. I don't wanna feel like I'm keeping my hands forward on this. Club shaft straight up and down, hinge back, release the club back to straight up and down, and then it's gonna release through onto the other side. Now, finally, let's talk about the high shot. This one, we're gonna play that ball position a little bit more forward in our stance. As you can see, it's more off my left foot here. Might I actually get the shaft to lean back? And it's very important here that we start with the face a little bit more open. So as you can see, I get that face nice and open at the, at the address position. So ball position forward, face open. And on this one, I'm gonna take a shorter backswing and finish with a longer follow through. So I'm kind of going short backswing, long follow through and it's going to get the ball to go up into the air and land nice and soft. So those are the three shots. Very easy to do, just get, watch the video through in detail. I put some slow motion videos in this video this week so you can kind of see in slow motion what I'm doing for each shot. And by watching this video 
closely with some detail, you'll be able to kind of pull some nuggets that can add your add value to your game. So watch watch the swing slowly, especially the slow motion videos, and I think it's going to really help your game. If you haven't done so already, please click on the subscribe button down below, and then also click on the uh, on the bell button just right next to it, and that will click up to all. So click on the bell button up to all. What that's going to do, it's going to allow you to see future videos that I come out with, and then also click on that like button if you like that but uh, like the video today. It really helps out my channel. Also, if you can, go ahead down into the comment section. If you like something about today's video or if you have a question specifically, please send that to me. I'd love to help you out however I can. And then if you find, if you know anybody that would be, that could benefit from this video, please share the video and share the link with them. And, and I'd love to be able to help out however many people I can. Thanks so much for watching today's video. I think this is going to help your game. And I look forward to seeing your comments down in the comment section. Thanks so much.